some mild heartache may occur, some feeling of dizziness may occur, but not every not everybody experiences the same things. Thank you. <laughs> the vaccination will be undertaken in three phases. We are currently implementing phase one, where we target our target will be health care workers, community health volunteers and facility support staff who are from our frontline workers. Nairobi has been allocated 72,000 doses of vaccine for the vaccination centers within Nairobi. NMS is, targe is targeting to vaccinate healthcare workers, both, as the director has said, in public and private sector. This entails around 5,000 healthcare workers in public sector and 22,496 in private sector, an additional 7,300 community health volunteers. The second phase will target those with conditions like diabetes and hypertension, among others, while the third phase will, ta will target all other eligible patients. NMS will also continue to provide quality PPEs for all its staff. The predominant strain for the coronavirus disease, where, which was evaluated even at the moment, remains the one on which AstraZeneca works. It is the predominant. Is, uh, zero surveillance or genetic genomic surveillance is now ongoing. It has started in Kilifi, Kisumu, and it will also be starting in Nairobi soon to start to evaluate the new variants and assess if there will be any challenge with the AstraZeneca vaccine. And finally, our rollout has started with AstraZeneca. That does not mean it will be the only vaccine Kenya will deploy. Kenya will deploy any vaccine under the COVAX mechanism and once we are also ready to join Africa CDC, any that will be available. At the moment, under the COVAX, we have Pfizer and Moderna. So any of them that will be available, you will start seeing some of these other uh, uh, vaccines also being deployed.